owners, there is a clinic where you can keep your dog or cat healthy on the cheap. Mm -hmm. The nonprofit Emancipet has a goal to provide pet owners with good care they can actually afford. The grand opening is today, and as Chris Davis found out, it could be the model for other new clinics. 11 week old Woody is new to vaccinations. His human, Constance Meisenheimer, isn't new to getting them at Emancipet. We've always brought our dogs here. Um, a long time ago, I used to use our vet down the street, and it was, I mean, three and four hundred dollars almost every time. It's not here. <coughs> so Woody's found his primary care vet. Well done, good job. So we have one person holding and one distracting. Ninja is getting checked for heartworms. If he has them, this new clinic can treat him. That's a change from their other spots where they could just perform the tests. But when an animal came up positive, then we had to refer them out to a regular clinic where that treatment can cost well over $1,000. Here, it's between 200 and 500. Along with those treatments, the clinic will do dental work and specialized surgeries. This bigger clinic gives them the space and the equipment to try out and refine the process. Once it's fast enough to be affordable, they can take it to their other, smaller clinics. So it's kind of a testing lab for us. Speaking of tests. She's negative. No! Yes. That is amazing yes. news, Ninja. Ninja dodged heartworms. Oh, exciting. Oh this is a big news for you. He doesn't know it, but he and Woody are helping the vets here figure out the future of their care. You good puppy. Oh, You're nice. a good boy. You're a good boy. Chris Davis, KXAN News. All right, so what next? Well, we know it takes a whole lot of money, about a million dollars to open up a clinic and get enough clients to make it sustainable. mansapet has been around since 1999 and says there's a whole lot of interest, but they're waiting for the next place to buy in. Currently, they have two locations in Austin, one in Pflugerville, Colleen, Houston, and Philadelphia, along with a mobile clinic. Break out the sweaters for the pets soon, too. <laughs> no kidding. They let you, right? Yeah, you're one of the people who puts sweaters on their dogs, right? My wife is. <laughs> okay. I can barely put a sweater on my kid. <laughs> doesn't like it. I'll tell you, tomorrow morning you have to fight with them because we're talking about wind chills in the 20s tomorrow morning. Now, it's